I'm Rowley, uh, this is Flying Camilla. Uh, we farm at Saddlescombe Farm and we're members of the Eastern South Downs Farmer Cluster Group. We, our farm is 450 acres, which is equivalent of 180 full-size football pitches. We produce food, we look after the landscape, but to make a living it's really important that we, we sell our produce, for us personally, locally. So we, we sell a lot of our produce to local restaurants and butchers in Brighton. At lambing time we have open days and we also offer people the experience to come and be shepherds for the day. If the farmers in the South Downs weren't here managing the landscape, the animals managing the landscape, things would look very different. Uh, there would be a lot more what we call scrubland, which is um, overgrown kind of trees and gorse. We wouldn't see the amazing wildflowers that come up every year as a result of the cows and the sheep grazing. All of our beef and lamb is completely grass fed. So we believe it tastes better because they are eating this delicious grass of, made up of the flowers and the grasses that is growing here throughout the year. It's when people come to the farm, buy our lamb or our beef, or they've eaten in a restaurant in Brighton or in a local pub, and in the school playground the following week, I will get someone coming up to me saying, we had your lamb at the weekend and it was absolutely delicious. Thank you very much. And as a farmer, that is wonderful. And that's why we're doing it. I would just love people as they walk through the countryside to realise that it is a working countryside. Um, and without farms, without the farmers and the animals, it wouldn't look the way it does. And I would love people when they're eating their food is not just to think about what shop it came from, but to actually kind of almost eat the landscape, eat the view.